Hey you guys, this is Mr. Millings, and today we're going to learn about the seven diatomic elements from the periodic table. There are seven elements on the periodic table that are never found alone in nature, people. These guys are the seven diatomic elements that when they are not bonded to another atom on the periodic table, these seven elements will always be bonded to each other. These seven elements are kind of like the conjoined twins of the periodic table. So what are they, people? Well, take a look. We have hydrogen. Hydrogen never is found alone in nature. If it's not bonded to another element on the periodic table, it will always be bonded to itself. It's diatomic. The prefix di means two. Oxygen, same thing. You'll never just find one oxygen atom floating around in nature. It is always bonded to itself if it is not bonded to a different atom on the periodic table. Same with bromine, same with fluorine, same with iodine, nitrogen, and chlorine. These are the seven diatomic atoms or elements that are on the periodic table of elements. So you have to memorize these. It's just something that you have to do. All right, so how are you going to remember these seven diatomic elements? Here you go, people. Hoberfinkel. Hoberfinkel. If we take a look over here, hydrogen, oxygen, bromine, fluorine, iodine, nitrogen, and chlorine. Together, if we line them up, that's going to spell Hoberfinkel. All right, so these are the seven diatomic elements on the periodic table. And you can think of it this way. These are like the uh, elements that are holding the hands of their identical twin sibling okay so hydrogen is always bonded to itself if it's not bonded to another atom on the periodic table oxygen same thing if it's not bonded to another atom on the periodic table it is always bonded to itself you'll never just find one little oxygen by itself it will always be o2 okay same with bromine you're never going to find just one bromine hanging out by itself it's always going to be br2 same with iodine never one little iodine atom by itself if it's not bonded to another atom on the periodic table of elements it will be bonded to itself same with nitrogen and same with chlorine so remember hoberfinkel people remember the seven diatomic elements and if you found this helpful go ahead and click that little bomb in the bottom right hand corner uh, and feel free to leave any comments in the comment section down below, and I hope this was helpful.